Mtazamaji sasa tuelekee viwanjani ambapo bingo wa Afrika katika mbio za miti 1500 Winnie Chebet atashiriki raundi ya Doha ya mashindano ya Diamond League ili kujiandaa msimu wa riadha wa mwaka 2021 ambapo ataazimia kufuzu michezo ya Olimpiki. Bingo wa mbio za miti 1500 duniani Timothy Cheriot ananuia kuandikisha rekodi hapo kesho ambapo pia aidha Ferguson Rotich na Wycliffe Kinyamali watashiriki mbio hizo. Chebet atashiriki raundi ya mwisho ya mashindano ya Diamond League msimu huu kesho kwenye mbio za mita elfu tatu kama maandalizi ya msimu ujao. My preparation is not bad. It's very hard. We train for uh, since uh, December last year. After now we are ready for that. Hata hivyo, matayarisho mwanariadha huyo mwenye umri wa miaka 29 yameadhirika kwa sababu ya janga la COVID-19, lakini amedai kuwa amepata afueni baada ya kurejea uwanjani, huku akizingatia kanuni zilizotangazwa na Wizara ya Afya na ile ya michezo. It is very hard but now I'm just training. You must be trained hard and you, you must be disciplined for training. You must be follow what the coach saying so that it, so that you can get a, a high for training. Uh, so that you can get a medal in Doha you must be followed a lot of rules. Chebet aliyeshinda taji ya bara Afrika mwaka 2018 jijini ya saba pia ana hamu ya kurejea mashindanoni huku akinuia kufuzu michezo ya Olimpiki itakayoandaliwa mwaka ujao. Mbio za mita 3000 zitawajumuisha wanariadha maarufu wa umu nchini miongoni mwao bingo wa dunia kwenye mbio za mita 3000 kuruka maji na viunzi Beatrice Chepkoech, Agnes Tirop na Gudei Tsegei wa Ethiopia. Msururu wa Diamond League wa msimu huu tatamatika kesho jijini Doha kufuatia kuairishwa kwa raundi kadhaa. Shukran Munga kwa taarifa hiyo sasa tuelekee kule ghaibuni ambapo raia wa Senegal Edward Mendy anatarajiwa kuania nafasi ya kujumuishwa kwenye kikosi cha kwanza dhidi ya Kepa Ariza Balaga na Willy Kabalero baada ya kuhamia kilabu cha Chelsea kutoka Reims kwa kima cha pauni milioni 22 kwa muda wa miaka mitano. Usajili huo unajiri saa chache baada ya Chelsea kufuzu raundi ya nne ya mashindano ya kombe la Carabao baada ya kuigaragaza Bansley mabao sita kwa nunge uwanjani Stamford Bridge. Mendy mwenye umri wa miaka 28 ni mchezaji wa saba kujiunga na Chelsea msimu huu kufuatia kuwasili kwa Hakim Ziyech, Timo Werner, Ben Chilwell, Thiago Silva, Malang Sarr na Kai Havertz. Mendy hakufungwa katika mechi tisa msimu jana alipoiwakilisha Reims huku akisaidia kumaliza katika nafasi ya tatu na kufuzu ligi ya mabingwa barani Ulaya kwa mara ya kwanza kwenye historia ya timu hiyo. Wakati huo huo, Chelsea ilifuzu raundi ya nne ya kombe la Carabao baada ya kuicharaza Bansley mabao sita kwa nunge. Tammy Abraham na Kai Havertz waliweka Chelsea uongozini kabla ya muda wa mapumziko. Rose Buckley aliongeza la tatu. Pinched it back after great work from Havertz and swept it in for 3-0. And that might be good night. Huku Havertz akiongeza mabao mawili. Abraham wants it in the middle. It's a lovely touch for Havertz. On target again. Great ball round the corner from Abraham for Havertz. Collins has made a mess of it. Havertz is going to walk it in for his hat-trick. Kisha Olivier Giroud akafunga la mwisho. Great ball in, Olivier Giroud pays it the compliment it deserves. And he's happy. Katika mechi nyingine, Everton itaikaribisha West Ham United uwanjani Goodison Park kwenye raundi ya nne kufuatia ushine wa bao matano kwa mawili dhidi ya Fleetwood Town. Here's Bernard. He dinks one in. Richarlison! Everton in front. Richarlison onto his right boots, trying to shape to shoot. Uses he will be gets it back and puts Everton two up superbly. Great link up play between Iwobi and Richarlison, and what a finish it was. Gets to the dead ball line, Richarlison and Everton have their two goal advantage back. Alex Iwobi, created by Anthony Gordon. There's the cut back, falls here for a brilliant strike from Bernard, and that should seal it, surely. 5-2 for the second game in a row, as far as Everton are concerned. 
job done. Mechi za raundi ya tatu zinatarajiwa kutamatika leo usiku. Bristol City itachora na Aston Villa, Lincoln City imaliza uthia na Liverpool, huku Manchester City kijitosa ugani dhidi ya Bournemouth.